shout outs to do, so we're going to get started. Okay, let's start with welcomes to the community. Daily Bumps with an S. Welcome to the neighborhood and go check out his channel, guys. Filipino Heat 44, welcome to the neighborhood. Brittany Archer, welcome to the neighborhood. Papa Texas, welcome to the neighborhood. And you guys need to make sure you go by and check out his channel. He's got an awesome channel. Andy Hawk, welcome to the neighborhood. Travis Lee, welcome to the neighborhood. Your Daily Duties, welcome to the neighborhood. Make sure you guys go by and check out their channel. They also have an awesome channel. Ha Ha Drew, welcome to the neighborhood. They also have an awesome channel. Make sure you go by and check them out. They kind of just went through something similar that Kevin and I went through last year. His channel got shut down, but he didn't get to reactivate his channel. He had to start fresh. So make sure you guys go by and show him some support. He's an awesome vlogger. YouTube is still unsubscribing people, so if you've noticed that you're unsubscribed, please sure resubscribe. Yeah. yeah. Smiles XO, welcome to the neighborhood and go by and check out their channel. Alexander Martinez, welcome to the neighborhood. Very good. Okay. Mr. Rickster, welcome to the neighborhood and make sure you guys go by and check out Mr. Rickster's channel. Okay, we got some birthdays. Very Merry Vlogs, happy fourth birthday to your niece, Emma. Vlog Epicness, happy birthday to your mom. Aussie Flicks, happy birthday to Jake. The Woodhouse Life, happy birthday to Fiona. Okay, a couple of shout outs I want to do. Um, Tiger TV 65 I know you guys have heard me talk about him before. This guy does not get enough credit. He does music videos, he writes his own stuff, he sings his own stuff. He's an amazing singer-songwriter, guys. Does his own videos, too. Go check him out. He is awesome. Go check him out. I love his videos. When I'm just sitting here cleaning or doing nothing, I'll put on his channel and I'll just put it on repeat and let his videos play over and over and over again. He's amazing, guys really go check them out. Sierra Ferguson, shout out to you. She says that we keep her from getting depressed and we love to hear stuff like that. So um, thank you very much. Thanks. And um, shout out to all of the new subscribers that we do have that have not left comments. If you would like to hear your name shouted out, just leave us a comment down below and we'll make sure to welcome you to the neighborhood and give you a shout out on our next week's shout out video. So welcome to everybody. And if you um, become part of the neighborhood and you're commenting very often, uh, you'll end up on our um, credit roll at the end. Yes, yes. Okay, we only have a couple of thoughts and prayers today. Um, no updates, but thoughts and prayers to Dave Nicholson. He's having severe fibro attacks. So if any of you guys don't know who Dave Nicholson is, go check out his channel. Um, we get a lot of our tags that we do from Dave Nicholson. Um, He's a tag master. Yeah, he is. So go check him out um, and keep him in your thoughts and prayers. And another channel, they don't, I don't think they watch us, but I've been watching them recently, Derek and Lisa. Um, they've had, the. They've, they've just gotten approved for adoption, but they have had three, I, I don't know if they, they call them miscarriages or what, but they've had three failed pregnancies this year. And their story is just so touching and so heartbreaking, and I've just been following it for a while now. And same with Water's Wife, if you guys haven't seen their channel. Go check out their channels. But please keep them both, Derek and Lisa and Water's Wife, in your thoughts and prayers. Um, 
I was lucky enough to be able to have a child, but there's a lot of people out there that are not lucky enough to be able to have children and that go through a lot of sadness and misery. And my heart really does break for those people. So please keep them in your thoughts and prayers. Um, this one month is not only Cancer Awareness Month, Breast, Breast Cancer Awareness Month, it's also Infancy and um, Pregnancy Loss loss awareness month so um, keep that in mind as well okay my question for last week is what was the most unusual job you've ever had I would say when I was in high school I got a part-time job working in this guy's garage with a whole bunch of other students where we would put manuals together in three rig binders there would be like pamphlets that were already hole punched or we would have to hole punch them and we would have to just walk around tables with these pamphlets and put them in the binders and just keep walking around tables pick up the next stack and put them in binders so, it was pretty boring but I was a high school student it was a paying job and I made money so okay I chose three people that I'm gonna read their answers Kara's life on the farm Cleaning horse stalls for 50 cents a stall. She cleaned enough stalls to save up $100 to buy a CD player. That's a lot of stalls. Yeah. Yep. The Abyss, 92882. When he was three or four years old, he helped give birth to a baby calf on a dairy farm. He helped his grandpa. I can relate to both of those because I've done both of those before. Yay. Yeah. Kaya Stoll, demolishing the Warf Warfield Theater in San Francisco, gutting the downstairs, which was a speakeasy. I'm wondering if you ever heard or saw anything strange or unusual while you were doing that job. Let us know. Kind of interesting to find out. Okay, and my question for today is a little different than my normal questions. I am going to ask you all to help name the spider in the room. Can anybody find the spider in the room? I need help naming my spider on my head. Some of you already gave me names, but leave your names, name suggestions down below on this video so next week we can pick a name for the new spider addition to the family. <laughs> It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll! I'll take Angel. <laughs> okay, so last week we asked a question about the movie The Purge election year 2016. It was this year. Uh, there was a thing about a candy bar. Uh, one of the characters was trying to steal a candy bar from a store and what was the name of the candy bar, and the candy bar was, um, and what does it have to do with other movies, I believe, I said. And the candy bar was called Apollo Candy Bar, which to me is a really weird name for a candy bar, but it's a fake name. Uh, apparently it first showed up in the TV series Lost, and the producers of Lost also apparently were involved in this, as well as, um, uh, what was the... Once upon a time, is that what it's called? Mm -hmm. So uh, apparently, it shows up. It shows up everywhere now. It's become one of those things like, well, like Morley cigarettes, which is a fake uh, cigarette company, will show up in movies everywhere. So it's the go-to fake candy bar apparently now. So okay, those who got that correct was Terry Johnson, the Abyss nine two eight eight two, and Tanya Longley. Okay, um, I have a sort of a, a general question, it has not a, any particular movie, but just a bit of trivia that I learned uh, just the other day. Uh, the movies, the Halloween franchise movies, that includes John Carpenter ones, plus the ones that happened after John Carpenter, plus the Rob Zombie uh, versions. Um, who, who was in more Halloween movies? Jamie Lee Curtis. Danielle Harris or Donald Pleasance? Ah, there you go. Good question. Very isn't it? good question. Yes, it is. Very good question. Uh, a couple of little 
little tidbits. Um, we missed Monday Night Trivia because I finally got some sleep. I'm not going to do it another night. We're going to wait and we're going to do it on Monday. We'll just skip this week completely. So uh, just look for that She next slept week. right through it. <laughs> so we're just going to do it next week. So just look for that next week. And we finally got a surgery date for my feet, October 28th. So keep me in your thoughts and prayers. That's coming up pretty fast. Um, and uh, we'll be filming dog hair in my mouth. We'll be filming dog we'll hair in your mouth. We'll be filming that um, right along. Right along. So you guys will get to see all of that as well. So anyway, that concludes this episode of... <laughs> what are we doing? T the shout outs! <laughs> I was gonna say TV movie trivia, but no, we're not doing that! We're doing That's the neighborhood only community stuff. shout outs! You are all part of our neighborhood, each and every one of you out there. We would not be here today if it weren't for all of you out there. We love you all so very very much we would not be here if it weren't for all of you i said that already didn't i over and over again <laughs> thumbs up make sure you go by and check out all our other stuff and we will see you guys next week on another episode of neighborhood community shout outs okay bye, bye.